Perfect attendance winners. And you could win lunch for your fourth period class. All today on On, on the, the Air. Air. Nah, it is posted on the blog, Robert Tevis. I'm the man, Braden Whited. School is Cool is a program from the Wayne County Area Chamber of Commerce, and every year they gave out a car or scholarship money to a Wayne County senior with perfect attendance. This year they're doing more and rewarding all students with perfect attendance, and they start this week. Good morning, students of RHS. We are here to celebrate School is Cool, and we are giving away some great prizes today. First of all, congratulations to all of the students that received perfect attendance for the first nine weeks. You will be getting passes to your choice of RecPlex, SportsPlex, or Family Fitness Works. If you missed something in the first nine weeks, be sure to show up every day anyway because we will be giving away prizes throughout the year for every grading period. Secondly, we chose names from those who got perfect attendance in the first nine weeks and we have two amazing winners here with us that had perfect attendance. Tell us your names. Brendy Mendoza. Rachel Shumanoff. Awesome. Congratulations, ladies. We brought Starbucks gift cards just for you. Congratulations. Enjoy that, and we will look forward to um, maybe seeing you again next time we're here. Okay, I have with me Amy Holdhouse. And Amy, what is School is Cool? What is that all about? Thank you, Melissa. School is Cool is an important program that was developed at the Wayne County Area Chamber supported by all local businesses that are members of the chamber. And why is that important? Well, for students, it's important for you to know that there are lots of people out in the community that care that you're at school every single day. And so our new motto is, school is cool, every day counts. If you miss a day, it's really important to come back tomorrow, the next day, and the next day. The more often you're in school, the better habits you're developing so that you'll be a good worker for our businesses when you graduate. And we have two last things to talk about. One is the fact that every student that has perfect attendance throughout the entire year will get a t-shirt at the end of school. And we don't design those t-shirts, you do. We have one winner from Wayne County High Schools that we choose along with a committee for the best artwork and that goes on the back of the t-shirts that will be distributed at the end of school. And lastly, specifically for you seniors, we have an amazing prize thanks to Wetzel Auto and First Bank Richmond and many, many other businesses. It is potentially a brand new car like this one. We will be giving away one car or a scholarship, your choice, at the end of school when we invite all seniors in Wayne County to join us for a celebration. Every senior that makes it that far will walk away with an amazing prize. So be sure you're in school every day. We look forward to seeing you soon. And for anyone at RHS that has a perfect attendance, you can pick up your certificate for your free pass to RecPlex, Family Fitness Works, or SportsPlex at lunch on Monday. Just go to the table in the cafeteria. The free pass is good through December 31st, so you have lots to do over Thanksgiving and Christmas break. Next week will be a short week, but there's still plenty going on at RHS. Let's take a quick look at some announcements, including a contest that ends next week that could earn your fourth period lunch. That's right, just a chill Friday in my new studio set, and we have just a few reminders and an important announcement about how your fourth period class could win lunch. The movement is having a contest to help raise money to help provide coats, hats and clothes to elementary kids who might be in need of them. Your fourth period teacher had an envelope delivered to them to collect the donations. The class that donates the most will have lunch delivered to them by the movement. You have until Thanksgiving break to get your donations in. Envelopes will be collected on Tuesday before we leave for the holiday. Good luck. If you ever wanted to play or already play Dungeon and Dungeons and Dragons, then join the RHS D&D Club. It meets every Monday and Wednesday, 3.30 to 4.30 in Mr. Schleybach's room 
L109. They'll be building characters and preparing for upcoming quests. Anyone competing on the RHS Fine Arts Academic Team, please stop by room R238 to pick up your materials and notebook to start preparing for the competitions. If you missed getting your picture taken last month, you can still get one taken. Picture retake day will be on December 2nd. Students who need a retake or missed picture day will get their pictures taken during their English class. That's your announcements. Back to you guys in the studio. The first snowflakes of the season and cold temperatures. It's time for the Red Devil forecast. That's right. You'll want to dress warm this weekend as we will see temperatures drastically colder than anything we have had so far this fall. While clouds move in today, we should remain dry and somewhat pleasant with highs reaching around 50. Tonight, colder air starts to move in as lows drop into the mid 30s by Saturday morning. For the rest of Saturday, we could see the return of rain. There's even a possibility that it could be mixed at times with snows as temperatures remain cold, only reaching the 40s. The rain brings along more wind and with the rain, the cold in the wind. We could even see wind chills dropping into the teens by late Saturday night. By Sunday morning, it won't be any warmer. Lows hit the 20s and things won't be much better for the rest of the day with highs only climbing into the 30s under sunny to partly sunny skies. One more cold night takes us to Monday morning as lows once again hit the 20s before bouncing back for a much better day on Monday with highs back in the mid 40s. We'll talk about the slight warm up in time for Thanksgiving break on Monday. Until then, stay warm. I'm Macy Thornburg, back to you guys in the studio. Let's check in with Houston in the Red Devil Sports Center for some important sports information. That's right, important information for those wanting to go to the basketball game next week and for RHS soccer players, which is where we begin. There are still some soccer players who have not turned in their equipment from this fall. Please get it turned in as soon as possible. Also, awards from the season are available to be picked up in Mr. Haynes' room, R207. These camps are meant to help players who want to play at the collegiate level. For more information, go to exactsports.com soccer. The RHS football team will hold their fall banquet this Sunday. The following players are asked to bring some of the following to the banquet. Freshman cookies, sophomores pies, juniors drinks such as punch or two liters, and seniors brownies or bars. Cake will be provided by the football parent group. If you need more information, see one of your coaches. It's time to see boys basketball team in action. Tonight is the annual red and white scrimmage. It starts at 6 p.m. with the Dennis 7th graders and Test 7th graders. That's followed by more intermediate school teams with the 8th grade Dennis and Test teams facing off. Then about 6.30, the RHS JV tips off. They'll introduce the varsity players about 6.55 before having a varsity versus JV and varsity red versus white scrimmages afterward. Admission is only a case of water or bath towel. Make sure you get an early look at this year's team. But you'll have to wait a while to get another look at the girls' boys' doubleheader against Indianapolis Howe schedule for next week. It has been canceled. Still, there is basketball on the schedule. The girls play tomorrow in Tiernan at 6 p.m. in their second NCC game. Logansport visits Richmond on Saturday night, so get out and support the Lady Red Devils. I'm Houston Carver with your primetime sports report. Back to you guys in the studio. That's the show. Make sure you get out and support the boys basketball team at the Red and White Scrimmage tonight. And on Saturday, make sure you show support as the girls take on Logan Sport. Have a great weekend. And stay warm. Eggs, cheese, ham, baby.